new review from Texas Tech shows us why chronic stress doesn't just stay in the brain, it rewires the gut. Stress hormones like cortisol, adrenaline, disrupt the microbiome, weaken the gut lining, and fuel inflammation. Think about our patients living in pain. That constant distress keeps their fight or flight system switched on. Those hormones slow digestion and shift gut motility. This makes it harder for beneficial bacteria to survive. Harmful bacteria can then grow and the gut lining becomes more permeable. This causes inflammatory signals to spread throughout the body. What looks like separate GI complaints, IBS, bloating, or food sensitivities may actually be a downstream effect of living with pain and distress. For clinicians, this helps us reframe the story we can tell patients. Instead of random comorbidities, we can explain how pain and gut issues are connected through stress biology. And importantly, interventions like stress management, diet changes, and probiotics can support both pain and gut health. Next time a patient with pain also brings up gut problems, connect the dots. It's one story, not two separate conditions.